Hi, I'm Kate from Zen Stitching and today we're going to explore something that I'd heard about but never had actually seen in practice and that is can you use kids washable markers as an alternative for other washable markers on fabric? Let's change camera views and find out. So we wanted to try figuring out whether these kids washable markers will work as a really good substitute for fabric markers working with craft projects. So I tried a previous example where I just drew stripes on a piece of fabric, but it was not very successful because a lot of the colors did wash away. So we didn't have a good reference for what stayed and what didn't. So this time around, I've actually marked out with a permanent marker each of the different colors that I have in the Crafty Kids washable markers range and I'm going to color them all in. So this way I can see what colors wash out and what colors leave a stain or what colors remain for that matter. So I actually mixed those up the wrong way. So I'll have to put a little note that that is that. So let's put this through the wash and we'll see what washes out, what stains and what remains. It's going to go into a regular wash with my other clothes. So it will be on warm, washed with a um, scent-free washing detergent and um, so nothing special and we'll see how it all comes out. And we're back again after having dried and ironed the um, sample. So you can see that the pink really does stain, which is quite fascinating. I really did think that it would have been the red that would have left more of a a stain and um, orange there's a slight edge there same with the purple and there's a slight marking there on the black as a an alternative for using um, the washable or dissolvable markers that you can get from the fabric store using these washable markers the kids washable markers can be a really good alternative i think i paid less than five dollars for a pack of 12 which is the equivalent of one washable marker i hope you enjoyed today's video experiment i think it's totally fascinating to see that we can use some of these colored markers as an alternative. I find this is really helpful when uh, working with Sashko just because uh, sometimes when drawing out the grid it's helpful to have different colors to delineate different parts of the pattern. If you enjoyed this video please like and subscribe so that you can get all future updates directly sent to your inbox. Wishing you many happy hours of stitching.